the call. And away they go. Winning prize hopped away smartly, but it's Little Jerry who wants the lead, and Little Jerry's ridden along in the white blinkers. War Academy at the rails, three of them line up on the lead. Balabali getting a good spot right behind the leading group. Down at the rail comes Gabriel Charles. They followed by Home Run Kitten, third last, and five off the leaders. Enterprising at the rail, and Telco is last. They head to the three-quarter pole, and War Academy sets a sensible pace out here. Not flying, leads it just over a length. Winning prize tracks from second. Little Jerry's on the far side, and at the rail, Gabriel Charles in fourth. Between horses comes Ballet Bali, now only two and a half or third leader. Home run Kitten on the far side. Enterprising travelling well at the back. Only four lengths off the leaders, and Telco is alongside of that. So they tightly grouped as they have a half mile to go, and War Academy shows the way, winning prize right there, second Little Jerry on the far side, and Gabriel Charles tucked in fourth. Bell Abali is fifth, only two lengths off the leaders now. Home run Kitten, then comes Telco and Enterprising. They are coming to the top of the lane, this one looks like it could turn into a cavalry charge now, number of horses going well. Winning prize, War Academy, Little Jerry, Bell Abali, desperate for somewhere to go, can Bell Abali get out of there? Telco on the outside, and then Enterprising. Homeward bound, Telco Co got first run, but Balabali now on the inside is coming home gamely. And it's Bell Abali on the inside finishing powerfully. And Bell A Bali, an impressive US debut. Bell Abali and Flavian Pratt win it about a length in the end. Telco second, a flying Gabriel Charles, and then winning prize. Ball of Bali delivers in his U.S. debut, and you watched it live here on TVG, both horse and rider showing their skills. It was a really good ride here by Flavian Pratt. Uh, was able to navigate through a hole, uh, and you watch the back uh, uh, track of this. Watch the four here. Gabriel Charles might have had a better fate. And watch the five in here. Talco. Victor Espinosa is caught behind horses, Simon. He's like, I have to go right now. I need to get out of this spot where the eight had to wait just a tiny bit. And so did Tyler aboard the four, Gabriel Charles. Four and those bright yellow silks down the rail. And look at the eight in between horses. Flavian Pratt was patient. He got all the breaks where Gabriel Charles just had to wait, come around a tiring war academy. But this is a nice horse and a rider that's really showcasing his skills here in this summer meet at Santa Anita. A couple of wins on the day already for Flavian Pratt. An easy win here. 8 5 4 3. See how long it gets? Flavian back like a pool table. Really gets low, man. You could drink a you know, set a drink on his back when he rides. That's how low he gets. Oh, Owner yeah, Rick right Porter with a trainer Papa Mandela walking to the winner's circle. Bal a Bali. Asu Brasileiro. I am Brazilian. What a performance today by Bal Abali, and now the lifetime record, 13 starts with 12 wins. Is this a horse to seriously consider in the turf division yep. leading up to the Breeders' Cup turf in the fall? Yes, it is, but still, it's going to be a challenge for him when he faces the European horse. We've seen that the last couple of years in California and America. You know, those turf horses, their fate is, you know, they're good horses until it comes to the Breeders' Cup, and that's when they get exposed. But this is a really nice and, horse. And, Paul, um, you know, for those who weren't privy to it, Simon did such a magnificent job talking about the fast times that Bala Bali had turned in in South America. When you look at the time here, the winning time of mile 135-3, and three, does it mean anything? No, it doesn't, because he finished up in 11 and change. So he was bottled up a little bit. He really only ran the last quarter mile of that race. And when you look at his PPs, he's got races where he did one th win races in 131-3. and three. He also won races going going a mile and 138 over heavy racetracks. To me, That's the point. that equates to him, maybe Arlington Million, so other racetracks where he could ship where, you know, he's going to be able to take a little bog or a little soft turf. Those times I was referencing earlier were mostly 99% of his race has been on soft or heavy ground. That's impressive yeah. to me. You know what Bala Bali passed today? The eye Bali test. Yeah. 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 He did. The eye test. He beat two good horses, yeah. too. I mean, Talco's in good form right yeah. now.